Hey guys, what's happening? Thanks very much for joining me today. And today was the day that Everkid was announcing their, their big tease. They've been teasing it for about four or five days now. So we kind of thought it was going to be something big. And I was really looking forward to seeing what it is because I've got the, uh, the XP collector's edition or limited edition um, pre-ordered which is coming out in the in the winter here so I was kind of looking forward to seeing what they were going to do now I had my suspicions what it was going to be but as they started to ramp things up with the tease I kind of thought I was wrong because I thought they were just going to say it was just going to be you know multiplayer or lobbies or anything along those lines but it was something a lot better and like I said I totally forgot today that it was coming out and I saw it about an hour ago, read through it, watch the trailer. It's fantastic. Now, if you have missed it, let's jump over and you'll see what we're talking about here. This is it. It's a Capcom collection built into the XP. So within the console, they're going to have 14, no, sorry, I'm wrong. I, let me get my numbers right. It is 18, 18 games built in to the XP. So it's going to be 14 arcade classics from Capcom and four home console games. Now this is really, really cool. We're going to be able to play these games without cartridges. Everything is built in. There's no downloads. It's actually physically on the, um, the, the, the machine when you get it. So as soon as you take it out of the box, press play, away you go with these 18 games. So this is really, really cool. So if we come down, we can have a look. 18 games from Capcom. You've got the, let's see, the, the game list is just down here. So it's 1942, 1943, 1944, The Loopmaster. I love that. Bionic Commando, Captain Commando, which is fantastic. Commando, Final Fight, Forgotten Worlds, Ghosts, uh, Ghouls and Ghosts. Legendary Wings, Mercs, Street Fighter 2, Hyper Fighting, Strider and Vulgus. So th those are your 14 big arcade titles and that's really really cool to see and then going on from that we have Mega Man, Mega Man 2, Mega Man X and Breath of Fire so those are the home console ones this is so cool and like you say no physical cartridge for the collection however they will include a manual which is in the in the box for your your console so this is so so cool and I'm really really uh, excited for this now so if you haven't got your pre-order you can't pre-order the, the the legendary edition anymore the limited edition but I can't honestly remember what they're, they're calling it the black one anyway but um, from September 6th you'll be able to uh, pre-order the, the the regular edition which you're still getting a lot of stuff for so I think the the regular edition there we are is 129 You've got your, let's jump into it and we'll, we'll have a, a look at it again. So you will get, um, obviously the Capcom collection is 18 games built into it. You will get a um, Irem uh, cartridge that comes along with it as well. You've got your big, lovely IPS screen, the Tate mode, uh, being able to play vertically. The, the For me, this was definitely a bit of a no-brainer because I don't have the original Evercade, the, the original handheld. I didn't get the Versus because I didn't like, I, I love retro and arcade games. I didn't like the idea of playing it on a console. And I know that's strange because I love arcade machines, which is kind of like a console, I guess. But I didn't, I didn't like the console idea. I love the handheld. I think this is just absolutely brilliant. So they're claiming four to five hours out of it. I'm certainly going to be stressing that out and seeing how much I can actually get out of that. I'll do a timer on it as well. So there, there I said, the Irem collection that you'll get, which has six games on there, that you'll get that as your pre-order. So there's 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 24, 24 games. That's a lot to keep you going. I think this is going to be really really cool and of course there's so many collections that you can you can pick up and the the collections do seem to go on offer a fair few times i think game had two for two for 30 quid only not not even a month ago and certainly the this machine 
for collectors is just bringing, uh, being able to collect the, the cartridges and the boxes, have them all displayed nicely. It's a really, really cool piece of kit and I'm really looking forward to getting my hands on. Again, they don't have a proper release date for it, it's just winter. So we're talking anywhere between, I guess, now did, did they say winter 2022? So that would be November, November, December. Oh, hold on. There is, there is actually a release date. That's changed. Available November 24th. So hopefully anyone who has their pre-orders in will be getting it around that time. That's really, really cool. I didn't know that. I've just stumbled across that bit of information. That's cool. I'm hoping the limited edition also uh, keeps that date as well. So I, I would, Anyone who's up for retro gaming on the go, this is definitely a win in my book. They've got Capcom, a big, big name, a big hitter. 18 games loaded onto it. And you've got ones that you'll love. You've got fighters, you've got um, side-scrolling beat-em-ups, Captain Commando, brilliant, brilliant game. Ghosts and Ghouls, I hope, I hope it's not the, uh, the dumbed-down version. I want it to be the original. Now, it does say it is the arcade, version so I'm hoping it's going to be hard and just frustratingly difficult you know Mega Man Mega Man X is on it that's fantastic as well so I'm really looking forward to to getting my hands on this now that was a great announcement from Everkit and I'm really pleased with with what they've done with it what do you guys think is it uh, have you got this on pre-order yet are you now thinking of pre-ordering the the regular edition let me know and maybe we'll get a game on it sometime. Catch you later guys. Take her easy. Bye for now.